How's it going, everyone? Nazem45 here, but actually, never mind. This isn't Star Trek Online at all. And that, everyone, is how you lose all of your audience within the first six seconds. So on Black Friday, which was like a month ago by the time this goes live, I was looking around on Amazon and found this. <laughs> Boom! It's it's Star Trek, so it, it still kind of counts towards my channel. That's how it works. This is the, 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 the this is this is the Starship collection for the USS Janolin that was in Next Generation that I've, I've never watched the episode. But this particular class of Starship has always had a little bit of a, a meaning to me, which I'll explain in a little bit. So I just thought, hey, why not I make a video and bore the heck out of my audience? So we're doing an unboxing video today. Yes, that's that's what we're doing. I've, I've never I've never done an unboxing video before. Um. Let's, okay, let's let's take a moment here. Let's go through our checklist of what we need to have. Okay, so professional camera, three-point lighting system, a college degree framing and composition, and a funny yet informative script. Maybe I should have actually prepared for something like this more. So so I guess the first part of any unboxing video is we actually have to, have to, to open the boxing. Like that's, that's part of the title. Okay, got that open there, so we got this book. That's cool. We'll set that up this side. And we got the actual toy right here. And then we have the best part of all, the bag. Plastic bag can be dangerous to avoid suffocation. Keep this wrapper away from babies and children. I mean, I don't know why they always keep these on these bags. I can clearly not breathe inside this, but other than that, I feel perfectly fine. That was a joke, by the way. Please don't sue me in real life if you do that. This is really hard to do with just one hand, just so you know. So anyway, the Janolin is a Sydney class transport ship that we see in uh, in a couple episodes, one being DS9 for only like a few seconds. And camera, camera, focus, focus. In one episode of DS9, oh, there it goes. And the other episode being uh, Relics in the Next Generation. So the reason I like the Janolin class so much is because even though I've never actually seen the episodes that had it, it's because someone once told me that while the ship was an inspiration for the Aquarius Escort in Star Trek Online. You know, looking back now, I, I, I feel like that I'm not sure I fully believe that because I can't actually find any supporting evidence, but hey, I, I paid money for this, so I'm gonna choose to believe it even if it's a lie. This is a really good model, actually. I like it. Then over in the back here, we have the, the base and stand. You know, I've never really understood, like, the point of unboxing videos. Is it, like, for, like, people who are, like, shopaholics? So they'll go online and watch people unbox things for that high. That way they can, like, feed into their addiction. That way they can still look into the mirror and say, yeah, I'm still a good person. Yeah, that's probably it. So we also have this thing. Yeah, I have no idea what the heck this is. <laughs> you know, the, the thing over here that probably has instructions in it, now that I think about it. Eh, screw that. Okay, how the heck am I gonna do this one-handed? Gently, gently. <clears throat> or maybe it's just supposed to sit like that. Yeah, I think it's just supposed to sit like that. So that's, that's the Janolin, everyone. That's really cool. That is really cool. All right, so let's shove that out of the way and let's see what this thing has to offer. Okay, d the Janolin, it's a, it, 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 Get that box out of the way. Okay, Janolin specifications in CC210. Cool. Yep, as I as I was saying before, that's the Sydney class Federation, 23rd century. It's 30 crew, 200 passengers. Wow, that's that's a lot more people that could fit in there than I thought. The phaser made. Oh, oh, there were instructions. Oh. Okay then. Uh huh. Didn't know that. And oh, that's a lot of text. So it's actually really cool, like the toy line that these uh, that these things come from. There's a lot of uh, of different ships that are available. Like I remember, I was looking on Amazon, and they even had like the the Amari class that uh, I made a, a video of about a month or two or three or five ago. I'm like, ah, hey, hey, sp sp speak of the Amari, there it is right there. And so yeah, they have a lot more of these ships that you can that you can buy on Amazon. That's the actual shop that you can get. Heck, if I know if that's lower price or not, I'm not endorsing them. I wouldn't mind being endorsed, but I I'm not, so. Anyway, yeah, so that's the Janolin from uh, the Starship, star, 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 Star Trek Starship Collection. Okay, yeah. I'm going to enjoy having this on my shelf, reminding me of the possible lie that it was the inspiration for the actual ship I like, that is the Aquarius Escort from Star Trek Online. Anyway, thank you all so much for watching, and I will see you all in the next video. This is going to confuse so much of my audience.